Hey, welcome back to Pillow Talk. Thanks for sticking around during the break. This is Kevin Fear, President and CEO of Mattress Express, a chain of luxury betting stores. If this is your first time hearing Pillow Talk, welcome. Uh, we do a lot of different things. We interview people in the industry. We review articles. We talk about beds. We talk about mattress covers. We talk about adjustable base. We talk about all different facets of betting and how they affect your sleep and on and on and on and on and on. And, and you know, this may come as an incredible surprise to you. I'm not a doctor. <laughs> so I just share with you what I've learned in my 15 years of being in the betting industry, being uh, one of the le leading betting retailers in New York State. Um, obviously, talk to your doctor about any medical issues we discuss. Um, today, we're going to talk about it, the moon in a minute at the moon. But before we do that, I want to get to the uh, question of the week. You know, I forget to do this sometimes. Uh, Adrian uh, emailed me from uh, the Mohawk Valley and says, I listen to Pillow Talk and I'm curious when you say technologies, what do you mean? We just covered this in a, in a recent segment. Uh, we carry all the different technologies. Uh, every, there's different technologies in bedding. Um, and we have them all under one roof. Um, traditional inner spring is traditional luxury. We carry that. Uh, there's foam beds. There's uh, memory foam and latex. There's air adjustable. Where you can make each side soft and firm. There's the purple grid, which is like a waffle. There is Tempur-Pedic memory foam, which is complete, has a completely different feel. There's hybrid mattresses. We have them all under one roof. No one else in New York State has all these brands under one roof and all these technologies side by side that we have. So you don't have to go from store to store to store to store. That's why people drive in from all over New York State to shop at our store. It's much easier. And we give you a, on, on most beds, we give you a 30 day sleep guarantee. If you don't love it, you can come back at, after 15 days and get something else of equal or greater value. You have to see the store for details on that. We have a 30 day price guarantee. If you find the same bed at a cheaper price within 30 days, within 20 miles of our store, we refund you the difference. Just did one the other day. We had a bed that went on sale and the customer said, hey, this is $500 cheaper now. I mailed them a check. So you know, it's risk free. It's a great place to shop. It's risk-free. We try to make you happy. Um, you can go to mattressexpressny.com. You can call 1-800-NEW-BEDS. Um, you can email me at pillowtalkquestion at gmail.com. By the way, Adrian, I hope that answers your question about the technologies. If you have a question, email me at pillowtalkquestion at gmail.com. You know, if you haven't noticed, I'm ADD, and I've never been treated for it. I made my way through life with it. Um, but you'll hear me jump all over the place. My brain like changes channels, click, click, click. So if you hear me going from one thing to another, it's ADD. Um, I'll tell you a quick funny story about myself. Uh, when I went to high school, I was bored to tears. Um, and I went to BOCES for auto body. I'm a car guy because I was just bored at school. And that saved my life in high school. I got to tell you, because I was just bored. And uh I went to college. I went to college for banking, insurance, and real estate. That's why I sell mattresses. Uh, and when I went to college, for this is for those of you that are ADD, you'll get what I'm saying. They, I bought every book the first semester they told me to buy. And I'll never forget, I was sitting in the library reading a macroeconomics book, reading a chapter we were assigned to read. And I was in two or three or four pages, and I realized I'm not absorbing any of this. I'm able to read and not really pay attention to what I'm reading because I'm bored. And uh, uh, at that, from that point on, I never bought a book in college unless I had to have it to work directly out of. Um, and I made it through college as a C student. That was how I dealt with my ADD. My claim to fame in college was I wrote a paper on a book I never read and got an A. I sat down the night before it was due and I skimmed the beginning of each chapter and wrote this paper and, and got an A on it. So you have ADD, there's hope. There's hope. It's a, it's a blessing and a curse. Helps me be creative and productive, but it also holds me back. So nevertheless, today we're going to go over an article about the snow moon. This is a, a, a clickorlando.com, but it 
talks about a full moon, a snow moon, and, and it says, the snow moon is nearly here. Will it harm your sleep? Um, what was the date of this darn article? This was published on February 21st, so the date's already passed. But it said this weekend, this is already passed, is expected, uh, the snow moon is expected to rise in the night over Florida. Now, obviously, we're not in Florida, but we have full moons here. It says, however, uh, it says the latest snow moon is set to grace the skies around 7.30 a.m. on Saturday. This is Florida. This is past. But, however, this could cause you to get worse sleep, according to a 2013 study. Researchers found that around the time a full moon comes about, Subjects, on average, had around 20 minutes fewer of sleep, took roughly five more minutes to fall asleep, and saw approximately 30% less deep sleep. Interesting. Let's see why they say that. During the study, participants were, were not able to see the moon. So they ruled out the idea that moonlight could be causing poor sleep. According to the Sleep Foundation, a possible cause for this phenomenon could be the moon's magnetic charge, which changes throughout its orbit around the Earth. Research now suggests that humans may be sensitive to low-level uh, geomagnetic variations. Huh. The Sleep Foundation says other geomagnetic events, such as geo geomagnetic storms and the aurora borealis, B-O-R-E-L-I-S, I'm pronouncing that wrong, that produce geomagnetic fluctuations comparable with the moon's impact, have been connected to a range of health effects, including headaches, changes in blood pressure and blood flow, heart rate, variability and even heart attack wow fascinating another theory is that the moon's gravitational pull impacts people like it does tides though scientists have said any effects would be almost negligible as humans don't have enough mass for it to be an issue okay then why bring it up anyway regardless the sleep foundation offers some tips for improving your sleep quality I love the first one. It says, invest in better bedding. A supportive mattress and pillow can ensure your spine gets proper support. High quality sheets keep you comfortable. It's true. Block out light. Too much light exposure can throw off your circadian rhythm. Keep it cool. These are things I always go over. Setting the thermostat to between 65 and 68 degrees can prevent you from becoming too hot or cold at night. That's also tied to sheets. Um, the type of bedding you're on. Do, do, do not nap too much. Keep naps around 20 minutes or less and try to take them in the early afternoon if you need to. We say this all the time. Disconnect devices, tablets, smartphones, and computers can keep your brain wired and prevent your body from winding down for sleep. And be careful what you drink. Limit caffeine after 2 p.m. and try to avoid having alcohol within an hour of bedtime. So, Interesting stuff. Does the moon affect your sleep? And the study says yes. I don't know. What do you think? Email me at pillowtalkquestion at gmail.com. Um, if you're waking up sore, if you're waking up in pain, if you're waking up unrested, you probably need a new mattress. I have a good friend of mine. <laughs> He's a retired school teacher, a, uh, educated, very smart man, does real estate now. And he said, you know, I think I need a new mattress. Mine looks fine, but it's been long enough. And he came in and he, he picked out the um, the uh, Puffy Monarch, which is their nicest one. And we delivered it, set it up. He got an adjustable base. And he said, oh, my God, I didn't realize how bad my mattress was. I feel incredible when I wake up now. And it's true. This is something we put off, folks. You haven't gotten a new mattress in seven to 10 years. It's time. It's time. You spend a third of your life in this bed. It affects everything you do. It affects your mental acuity, how you drive your health, how you perform at work, your relationships, your blood pressure, everything. Stop. It's time to come in and get one. Go to mattressexpressny.com for locations. Call 1-800-NEW-BEDS. Or just stop in to any store. There's no appointment necessary. If you think you found a good deal locally or online, bring it in and say, do better. We love it. We love it. Hold our feet to the fire. We have all the brands under one roof. We're up against the break, folks. The next segment's pretty interesting. Stick around. This is Kevin Fear. This is Pillow Talk. I'll be right back. <laughs> 